Assalamu alaikum and hello everyone. How are you today? For today, we will continue our lesson on Mathematics Year 4 KSSR Semakan 2017. The topics that we are going to learn today is fractions of quantity. You can refer into your textbook page 83, 84, and page 85. So let's start our lesson today by looking at example number one in your textbook. The boy said, I will put one over five of the total number of curry puffs on each plate. As you can see in the picture, you can see 14 pieces of curry puff in the big plate and another one in the boy's hand. So, the total number of curry puff is 15. So, the boy want to put 1 over 5 of the 15 in each plate. So, the question is, how many curry puff are there on each plate? For method number one to solve this problem, you can use diagram or picture to understand the situations. If you put the curry puff into five plates, it will be like this. Plate number one, plate number two, plate number three, plate number four, plate number five. If we count five, over 5 plates of 15, it will become 15 curry puff. But the question asks you to find the quantity of 1 over 5 plates. So you need to find out what is the quantity of 1 over 5 plates. So 1 over 5 plates that's mean 1 over 5 of 15 curry puff equal 3 pieces of curry puff. So, you will get there are 3 pieces of curry puff on each plate. By using method 2, you need to do calculation by looking at words of. Word of denotes multiply. So, if you find out a sentence like this 1 over 5 of 15 the word of here means 1 over 5 multiply 15 so of here means multiply or times so you need to calculate this 1 over 5 multiply 15 so you directly multiply 1 with 15. So you will get 15 over 5. And then 15 over 5 actually is 15 divide 5. So when you divide, you will get 3. 3 here mean 3 curry puff on each plate. Now, let's move to example number 2. 5 over 7 of 35 penganan were served to guess how many penganan were served. So, you get here 5 over 7 of 35. You need to find out what is the quantity of 5 over 7. So, as we learned earlier, the word of here is actually multiply. So, you write again, 5 over 7 times 35. Beside of multiply 5 with 35, we can also use cancellation. Cancellation means you divide 7 divide by 7 
equal 1 and then for 35 you also divide by 7 35 divide by 7 is 5 and then after that you multiply 5 with 5 5 times 5 equal 25 over 1 25 over 1 equal 25 so 25 here mean 25 pieces of penganan were served that's how you get the answer next question is example number three one one over five of 20 equal unknown so we write again one one over five we replace off with multiply 20 equal this question is involving mixed number if you want to multiply the fraction you need to change mixed number into improper fraction how you do that you must convert it by multiply 1 with 5 1 times 5 equal 5 5 plus 1 equal 6 so you get 6 over 5 times 20 equal so you know that 5 and 20 you can do cancellation by divide by 5 5 divide by 5 equal 1 20 divided by 5 equal 4 and then you multiply 6 with 4 6 times 4 equal 24 over 1 which is equal to 24 so 1 1 over 5 of 20 equal 24 Example number 4, 2, 2 over 3 of 90. So, we write the mathematics sentence, 2, 2 over 3 times 90. The mixed number here, you need to convert it into improper fraction. 2 times 3 equals 6, 6 plus 2 equals 8. You get 8 over 3 times 90. So, it is obvious that you can do cancellation by divide 3, divide by 3 equal 1, 9 divide by 3 equal 3, 0 divide by 3 equal 0. After that, you multiply 8 with 30. 8 times 30, you get 240 over 1 which is equal 240 so 2 2 over 3 of 90 equal 240 i hope this explanation will help you to learn fractions of quantity have a nice day good luck and see you soon bye bye